Hello, and welcome to another edition of Etika Battles. Before we get anywhere, I want to make sure to thank all of you for the massive amounts of friends, subscribers, and viewers. I am truly happy that my humble videos are able to entertain you all, and best believe I will maintain the said policy for all my future videos and endeavors. I also got a new mic, can you tell? <laughs> Anyways, I was battling one of my fellow roundtable members named Legend, who I know in real life, and this is a very good match, so sit back and look forward to it. So, as you all saw, he goes into the Tangela, and I Brave Bird, of course, thinking I'm going to take him out with one hit. Now, he has the Evil Light on, so he survives it, and he Leech Seeds me. So, I'm not too worried right now. Even though the Brave Bird recoil did a lot to me, I'm still able to do some damage with Albatross. So, um, he switches out, of course. I don't blame him, and I go for the Brave Bird once again. Now, Crobat's defense, nowhere near as high as Tangela's, so I'm thinking he's dead, but he survives it with a smidgen, and so do I. <laughs> anyway, so... Probat heals up a little bit, and then he gets the Leech Seed off, which finishes me. I swear, Leech Seed does more damage in this gen than it did in the other ones. <laughs> anyway, so um, that's done. I sent in Abiyoyo, another new member of my team. And um, she's meant to be the Retaliation replacement. But I know he's got a Ghost on the team, so instead of going for Retaliate, I go for the Shadow Claw. And um, it was a good prediction on my part, but it didn't do as much as I wanted. Because Spiritum has no weakness. So I go into Trix, another new member of my team and he goes for the trick. Now he gives me a choice band and I wind up giving him my choice scarf. So I'm thinking, okay, no, no much of a big difference really. So I thunder wave him and now you would think I'd be stuck on this. However, I have the klutz ability and the klutz ability allows me to run around with the choice item as much as I want using multiple moves with it. But I don't get the speed boost. Anyways, he goes for the um, Jolteon and um, I Encore thinking that he would go for the Sucker Punch again, but he didn't, so he sends out his Tangela. So I use Switcheroo. <laughs> and using this, I'm effectively able to give Tangela the Choice Band and take his Evo Light. And then I Thunder Wave him. In two moves, I was able to completely cripple his Tangela. Um, I, I know it shouldn't be like glorifying it, but still, I find it pretty smart of me. Anyway, so I go into Abiyoyo thinking that I could use a move to take him out. And he goes for the Giga Drain. Now look how much this does. Like, it does a lot of damage. I mean, considering the Tangela ha is not really an attacker. I mean, it did a lot. So, um, he withdraws. And he sends in his Crobat. And I just finish him off. You know, I was going to go for the Retaliate anyways to take Tangela out. But he switches, so it's no difference to me. So, um, that's about that for him. And he goes into my champ. And I'm like, okay, no way I'm letting myself stay in here with this. So, I go into Bermuda to absorb fighting moves specifically. Now, um, he goes for the Dynamic Punch. And I'm able to take that pretty well but I get confused. So now the big question is, can I beat the confusion hacks? And I do, for the first time, Air Slash. And um, it does a lot, because I have no special attack in Bermuda. But hey, he goes for the Ice Punch, and I have defense EV, so this shouldn't be doing... Uh, it shouldn't be killing me at least, but it's my champ. It has a lot of attack, so um, it really... It, it, it really, really fist fucked me right there. So he goes for the Bullet Punch, and um, it's not enough to take me out because it's not stab but I'm able to get through the confusion again, and I Air Slash. So um, that was very lucky on my part, because I could have gone a totally different, ugly route. But it didn't, so he goes back into Spiritum. Smart, of course. Very, very smart. I mean, like, Legend, he really had me here, because I couldn't switch. So I just go for the Air Slash to try to, like, flinch him out, but he goes for the Pursuit. And that is that. So, um, I get taken out that way. Now, I'm gonna pause right here. Actually, no, I'm not going to pause. I'm just going to keep on talking. Anyway, so Abiyoyo comes out, and I go for the Earthquake to try to finish this thing off. And, um, it does. Oh, pause. Okay, so um, you pretty much saw what went down. Um, 
he uses Crafty and he hits me with the Ice Punch, but I have EVs in defense, so it doesn't even do all that much. And um, I hit him with the Earth Power, but it's not able to kill him, so that was a sacrifice I had to make, but at least I don't have a full health Scrafty on my ass. So Virgo goes down, he gets the Moxie Boost, and I shit my pants. But instead of getting worried, I know I have somebody fast, so I send in Abiyoyo to clean up, and I go for the Earthquake, and um, this should be able to take him down. Abiyoyo has a lot of attack. And even with his defenses, he still can't take an attack like that. So he sends in his Tangela once again. And I switch out, and I go into tricks, because I want to be able to kill this Tangela with the retaliation at full power. So uh, I have to sacrifice tricks in order to get my retaliation out there strong. But I'm thinking I can still mess around with him while tricks is out there. So um, he withdraws because he's choiced. And <laughs> crippled from before. I mean, that's really messed up. And he goes into Jolteon, now I Encore. But, um... I'm getting sapped by the leech seed, and on top of that, I'm taking attacks, so I'm not gonna let Trix live for too much longer. But that's only because the greater reason is to get a full power retaliate out to kill somebody. So, um, he withdraws again. He sends in the Tangela. Now, on my Encore once again, just trying to get something to kill me here, you know, I, I need to die. So, I'm um, finally, with enough stalling out, I'm able to let Trix take the KO. Now, no disrespect I love tricks like he's one of the most intricate and interesting members of the team but I had to sacrifice it here so I apologize girl I'm sorry for that but I sent in Abiyoyo Abiyoyo retaliates full power hit this hits Tangela right between his fucking eyes and he lives it with a little bit of HP so I'm like okay well I'm chanting now and I take the Giga Drain and it does a lot of damage and I have a lot of HP so it heals Tangela to a pretty decent amount plus his leftovers but the retaliate again even at half power should still be able to take him out and it does so that was a very good um, play on my part although his tangle up was a real nuisance this match even with him being crippled so um, I send in Cruz to take a hit from this guy again and then I'll retaliate with the earthquake from Abiyoyo so it was a very good match but um, very decent Legend is a good player and that was good yeah Very interesting match from Legend. That went along pretty well. Um, I could have played a little safer with my girls, but you know what? Albatross and Tricks were sacrifices that I had to make there. But you know what? I'm figuring out ways to play better with them. I hope you enjoyed the new members of the team, too. I figured I would try to get comfortable with some other Pokemon. So um, I I'm pretty confident in the choice that I made now. So um, you'll definitely see a lot of these girls in the future. Um, also, I have... Uh, another fellow roundtable member whose name is Mike, aka Sable, making videos as well. So I'm going to leave a link in the description below to go to his video so you can check him out too. He's very interesting also. So um, please give him a look around too. And I'll also leave Legend's profile in the description as well. So please give him a look as well. Um, thank you all for the endless reception that you've been giving me. I really appreciate it. I just hope I can do more for these battles for you in the future. Take care. Be well. Eat right. Get good grades. Get good girls, get good guys, and um, that's about it. Peace. Take care.